Okay, so here we are with the hyenas. Because female hyenas actually have a penis-like structure that can make them incredibly difficult to tell apart visually from males. In fact, it used to be thought that hyenas were hermaphrodites because it was so difficult to tell the sexes apart. This structure is in actual fact the female's clitoris, which has become elongated so that it can be up to seven inches long and can even be fully erect. In addition to that, their labia has fused to form something like a scrotum and is filled with connective tissue and fat that make them look like fully formed testes. This means that female hyenas have to urinate, have sex, and even give birth through this structure. And even heterosexual sex is a complicated affair as the females effectively have to retract their clitoris in order to allow for copulation. Giving birth is also incredibly risky because it has to, in effect, take place through their clitoris and can be often fatal for both the mother and the infant. Spotted hyenas live in a matrilineal society, which means that females are the dominant out of the group and can live in clans of up to 80. And the females will also frequently engage in queer and lesbian behavior in which they will flick their erect penis-like structure against their belly, which is a sign of sexual arousal. They will uh, lick each other's genitals and they will even mount each other. So that's it for the mammal gallery. Um, if you want to duck out now, then feel free. But alternatively, you can join us as we go over to the bird gallery to find out a bit more about some queer penguins and swans.